so we have got this patient who had a road traffic accident and he is having he is having this complaint of this you no know, the mismatch of occlusion you can see this is a break or breach of gap okay and these segments are mobile so we can uh, say that there is a fracture and when we get a fracture like this we should examine like this we should start palpating the lower borders right from the condyle posterior border of the ramus angle lower border lower border betha hole bolbe betha lagle ekhane betha ache tai to so here he is having pain also pain does not mean that there is a fracture there is a cartoon so the pain may be due to this but clinically as we are seeing this you know this displacement there is a definite fracture so that will be confirmed by a ct scan or opg x ray so now i am again palpating ekhane betha ache ekhane betha ache chaple ha chaple betha ache so so he is having pain in this region only and also we can see on the over the face if you see the face there is no such swelling redness of the eye and other uh, things that be suspicious with fracture still i will just ask ekhane kono betha ache i will ask the is there any pain or not so there is no pain so nothing to worry about the mid face he is having the fracture in the mandible now we will we will just advise him with the opg x ray and i will show you the opg x ray so this is the opg x ray as i have mentioned there is a fracture in the parasympatial region that is going obliquely towards the body okay so this is a two dimensional image three dimensional image will be better in ct scan but we can clearly see there is a fracture line oblique fracture in mandible and we have to reduce this fracture we have to establish the uh, previous occlusion and we will uh, place two mini plates here and in some cases of this type of oblique fracture sometimes lax screw is very uh, very much uh, better or it works nicely lax screw to lax screw parallel lax screw also uh, works nicely so let's see we are planning for the surgery and we will do a open reduction and internal fixation